Right, welcome to Revelator Al. So, just going to take you on another quick trade on this big adventure bike here. Uh, this Triumph Explorer 2017, which I'm still riding. Uh, pretty much going everywhere now. Revelator Al. I've got this track. I found this track a couple of well, weeks ago. And uh, it's pretty cool actually, it goes through the forest and everything, it was like on a, a bit of a bluebell trail. Uh, so catch my other video for that if you want. But actually it actually goes further which I, than I took it, so I'm going kind to of, kind of curtail this, uh, was it that way or that way? Uh, okay I'll go this way, I can't remember which way it was now. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to curtail this part and then uh, go uh, up onto the other part and see how far I get. Oh, right, it's, uh, it's a bit probably as I say, these big uh, adventure bikes. It's you've got to really be aware of of the um, of the weight of them. You see, because they can easily just flip you off, and because they're so heavy, you know, it's hard to recover. Uh, this way, thank you. I knew it was somewhere, I just couldn't remember which one it was. There we go, right. Uh, so up here, I think. That was a lovely ride through here, no doubt. And uh, so a lot of sort of four by four country as well. Still got to be wary of these hidden ruts as well. Well, that's which really does affect these big, big adventure bikes. Uh, okay, I should have gone up that way. What a donut. All right, cool. Uh, there we go. This is nice. This is just like a, a track, isn't it? Like a grass track. Beauty. Can't just keep on coming up here. And then I'll go around there. Well, it's a beautiful morning. Very nice. I'm sort of standing up on the pecs here, just give myself a little bit of authority. There's a bit of uh, dew on the grass, so it's uh, making it a little bit slippery. The ground beneath the tyres is a little bit soft in places. And obviously these sort of hidden ruts that you can kind of slip into as well. So sometimes it's not always, but uh, it's better to... Right. Oh wow, look at that down there and that down there. Uh, let me go and investigate down here. Well, this is beauty. Okay, if that goes that way, that goes that way, right. Let me go this way then. Come on here, look at that. Bird watching thing, or whatever. Beauty. Yeah, my. There's a bit of a camber here, or slope, it's going from left to right downhill and the bike actually wants to slip downhill would you believe uh, so i'm kind of having to lean uphill uh, watch out for these ruts the, although i'm going really slowly would you believe the rear tire really does want to kind of slip and slide all over the place and sort of i'm kind of at some point i'm just kind of having to lean uphill just to keep the bike you know from uh you know rolling down the hill uh, okay, no, sorry, I thought that was going to be a, a turning. Right, so what about this way? Is this going? Oh, that's the end of the road. Oh, that was it. Uh, oh, bugger, I thought that was it. Right, okay. We'll go this way then. Go back again where I came. 
I thought there was actually going to be a trail there, but uh, actually, uh, either I'm not seeing it, or it just uh, stops. Well, yeah, so I'm going to get back up on these pegs. And it has been raining quite a bit recently. So a couple of weeks ago I was out in the forest and it was virtually bone dry. It was really, you know, it's really odd for this time of year as well. Really dry. Then we've had a, about a week of, I wouldn't say constant rain, but intermittent rain. Then all of a sudden it changes, you know, the forest floor and the tracks quite significantly. Uh, any, of you, any of you go sort of forest riding, you kind of know what I mean. It kind of changes, it holds the moisture a lot more, you know. Look, you can see where I've been riding here, blimey. Look at that front tyre, crikey, eh? it's searching a bit there, blimey. That's not good for business. All right, up we get. As I say, it's the weight of these things. So you can do it, but you've got to go a lot slower a lot more cautiously and just watch that weight as it kind of shifts really quickly you know uh, right okay so what I'll do I'll go up here then oh, this is this is an easy compacted trail this one nice oh beauty look at this Really nice. Ooh, duck beneath the branches. And again. Oh, and again. God, something we're riding trails through trees. Can't see having to duck down. And that's why sometimes I say, you know, it's actually a lot easier just to stay seated, you know. In fact, I will. Tire wants to search a little bit. I'm gonna watch the speed and keep on the compacted stuff. Beauty. Absolute beauty. This is a really kind of sludgy beneath here. So if you're wondering why I'm going so slowly through that bit. Well, this is a cool trail. I've got to say, like I rather enjoyed that. Now I know, I'm pretty sure there's another trail through here on the left hand side, you know. Well, that was it, ladies and gentlemen, coming to the end of it. Hope you enjoyed that and uh, well, just a cheeky little trail in the morning. A little bit slippier than I thought it was going to be, especially on these big adventure bikes. They are a bit of a pain in the arse sometimes. Right, catch you on the next one. Ta-da now.